in 2014, I started Little Brick Pastoral as a way to celebrate Australian agriculture, which means, as Alex said, I devote my spare time to creating and photographing Lego minifigures undertaking everyday farming activities. I love Lego photography. And Lego photography, I might note, is not an unbeknownst thing. There are hundreds of Lego photographers, or logographers, as we're better known, around the world. But until 2014, there wasn't someone photographing a farmer. As a farmer, I love all things agriculture and sharing our industry through a unique childhood toy. This year, Littlebrook Pastoral has partnered with Art for Agriculture and Career Harvest to bring agricultural careers competition to life. You may have seen the photos and minifigures that I created especially for this competition. Let's have a look. There's an agribusiness banker, an agricultural teacher, an agronomist, a biosecurity officer, an engineer, a geneticist, a GIS specialist, a mechanic, a research scientist, and a stock and station agent. Did you take particular note of that geneticist? She might look a little bit like Lynn Strong. <laughs> For the careers competition, students were asked to base their entry on one of those characters or to design their own. And wow, I was so inspired by the creativity of the Lego builds and photos that came in. Well done to all the entries. They are just amazing. In addition to my characters, we now have a wool classer, a contract musterer, several engineers, several animal welfare officers, a helicopter pilot, two architects, architects and a builder, a florist, a couple of vets, a pest controller, plenty of farmers and station managers. We received entries from rural and urban schools, from a school in distance education program and from the Port Augusta School of the Air. And in all, students identified 22 unique agricultural careers. I would now like to invite Ben Stockman, CEO of PIFA, that's the Primary Industries Education Foundation of Australia, to the stage to present our National Ag Day Career Competition winners. And the winner of the National Ag Day Careers Competition Primary School winner is Tom Ramsey. Now, unfortunately, Tom can't be with us today. Tom lives in Charters Towers, Queensland, but he's put together a little video about his entry. So let's take a look. Hi, my name is Tom, and I'd like to tell you about my passion for agriculture. I learn at home via Charters Towers School of Distance Education. Using a laptop, I log on to scheduled lessons with my teacher and classmates. My three main interests are riding motorbikes, doing cattle work with Dad, and hanging out with our dogs. My three favourite school subjects are IC, Maths, and Science. At the moment, I'm in primary school and I'm in Grade 5. I live on a cattle station and help my Dad with cattle work whenever I can. My future in agriculture. First, I will continue studying for school. Then, while I'm studying, I'll take available courses to learn more about cattle and their behaviours, as well as what sort of country they can thrive in. Next, I will graduate and go to Ag College to learn more about cattle. While I'm at Ag College, I'll try to become known among cattle property owners. Then I'll become a full-time contract master for beef cattle. This is how I imagine a day in my future career would be like. My day starts early with a loud alarm. I hop out of bed, get dressed and have brekkie. I go outside and fuel up my motorbike that I unloaded off my truck when I arrived the previous evening. I let two of my dogs out who are keen and ready for the muster before meeting the other musterers at the yards. 
We had out to muster 600 head of cows with their calves from a large paddock. We get them into the yards by lunchtime. After lunch, we draft the cattle, then brand and ear tag the calves before mothering them up and walking the cattle back out in separate mobs. I get home, take my dogs for a run and go to the homestead for a dinner and a yarn with the boss and his other workers. At the end of the day, I am coated in dust and tired, but I still feel glad to have got the day's work done while enjoying my job.